In my previous video, I covered the unboxing of the Stumac ES335 guitar kit. In this video, I'm going to show the steps that I took to prepare the neck to join the body before staining. Set neck. We want to make sure all of our gaps here and here are even on both sides. We have a little bit more of a gap on this side, which I can't line the camera up well enough to see. And I want to try to uh, close this gap in a little bit more. I'll probably... But the way we do that is just with a little piece of sandpaper cut to about, uh, say, a quarter inch to half inch. We're going to look at our gap here. See that it's a little tall. Stick our piece of sandpaper in there, lightly squeeze back on the neck, and pull. Until you figure out your pressure, you may potentially rip the sandpaper, which I've done a couple times already. You don't have to do this very much. We're just shaving a little bit off for it to fit more properly. It looks a lot better on this side, and I don't want it to be lopsided, so I'm going to do the same on this side. It's important to note that you want the sandpaper to contact the back of the neck joint and not on the surface of the body. Just putting moderate pressure at the neck joint. Recheck it. This side looks good. I expect to have a little bit of a gap down here because of how the body shapes inward, and that will fill with glue. Because that should not tilt backwards, and it does not. So once that's glued in, Looks like I need to take a little bit more off the horn up here. I need to take some off of here to make it fit just a little bit better. This gets a little trickier because I have the binding there and I don't want to hurt the binding. So I just want to take it off the neck and not off the body. and I'm just letting the weight of the neck do the work. Same on this side. Something you hear in the background is our pool cleaner. So a little bit more on this side. This side looks perfect all around. Uh, I could probably take five more swipes actually. I don't know if I can catch that, but that's a nice, beautiful joint there. Fairly well matched here. A little high here where the body curves in. The glue can fill that in the sawdust. 
on this side it's going to be the same. I don't want to go into the neck too much. I have a uh, an Epiphone dot that I'm going to take measurements from and make sure these are fairly similar and make sure my pitch is right. That thing is noisy. So I just have to take some more off of this side. Give it about eight swipes. Wonderful. Now the neck is fitting with no movement, no wiggling, everything is perfectly tight. I need to take some quick measurements and make sure there's no twist. I am actually, before I go any further, I am going to run the sandpaper down here um, probably 12, 15 more times to smooth things out. There's quite a bit of glue on this back side here where they put the pieces together and then they chiseled it out. It doesn't look like it was machined out. So I just want it to be nice and smooth. That's a much better fit. Perfect. That's where I'm going to leave it. I know my hand's in the way. That's where I'm going to leave her.